Hi, I'm William Castle, and this is Trailers from Hell. Today we're going to look at the trailer for the 1959 remake, the epic Ben-Hur, directed by William Wyler. God announces Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer is bringing you... What, what is it? What? What? Ben-Hur, directed by William Wyler. I like Ben-Hur. Ben-Hur is based on a book by a Civil War general named Lew Wallace, A Tale of the Christ. It is really big <laughs> and has some wonderful things in it. There's corniness, yes. Uh, did you even know the Japanese spoke English then? Anyway, this is a picture that won more Academy Awards than any other picture. Nice matte paintings. Big spectacle, big sets. This is the best sequence, ramming speed. It has pretty good costumes, too. It's actually not stupid, which is hard to do when you're making an epic like this, especially A Tale of the Christ. There's Zumunda. The sea battle miniatures are not great, but the interior stuff is fantastic in the galleys. And that whole sequence of the movie is really good. Jack Hawkins, it's... It's a good movie. I actually find it very entertaining. It's not as camp as uh, DeMille's Ten Commandments, and I think that's because Weiler was more intellectual. Um, has terrific Roman centurion uniforms. That's Stephen Boyd. Stephen Boyd and Charlton Heston were boyhood friends in Judea. Chuck is a Jew which came as a surprise to the NRA. But he's Jewish in this one, and Stephen Boyd and here were close friends until Stephen comes back from Rome. The famous story that Gore Vidal tells, Gore was one of the many writers of the script, is Stephen Boyd and he had a conversation where Stephen said, you know, Gore, it reads as if Masala and Ben-Hur were lovers when they were young boys. And Gore said, well, that's how I intended it. And Stephen said, well, that's great. I can play it like that. That explains my anger and my rejection and my rage. So he goes to Weiler and he says, uh, Willie, um, I've had a conversation with Gore. Can I play Masala like Ben-Hur and I were, were lovers when we were young men that were gay? And William Weiler leaned over and said, that's excellent. Do it. But don't tell Chuck. Now, whether that's true or not, I don't know. The chariot race in the silent is where horses and people were actually killed. That was shot in Culver City. This chariot race was shot in Rome, and no horses or people were injured. But there's a spectacular mishap where Joe Canut doubling Ben-Hur. He goes over these two chariots, and in real life, he flipped up over the top. They had to cut, there was mass hysteria, but he was not hurt. So Bundy Marton went back in later and shot an insert of Charlton Heston climbing back in the chariot. It's a spectacular piece of action. I like this movie.